Hello, hello everyone. This is your host, Steve, Jojo the Awesome speaking, and welcome back to Vault Hunters 118. Last episode, we ran some amazing vaults and found some amazing loot, most of which is going to allow us to continue our conquest of gear crafting. Check it out if you don't know what I'm talking about. Today, I want to make good on the conversation we had about crafting vault pickaxes. To craft our vault pickaxe, we need two driftwood and three vault ingots, and bam, here we go. It's got 4,000 durability, regular reach, regular mining speed, and no copiously. Now, on its own, this pickaxe, I believe, is no better than a diamond pickaxe. However, if we create the tool vice like so we can modify this guy to a crazy amount. First of all, you can see it inside, which is so awesome. And looking inside, it wants bronze plating, something called red vault essence, chromatic steel, silver scrap, and netherite scrap. Red vault essence, by the way, is just vault essence and painite. Might as well craft all our painite into it. As you can see, we're too poor to really do anything. The only thing we do is upgrade our durability, and let's be honest, durability is kind of lame. So for now, we're going to put this guy away, and there really is only one thing we can do. Ooh. Run more vaults, baby. Ah, yeah. I know last episode was so vault heavy, but I am just in the mood to run them. And we have our new fancy axe, and I almost forgot, I, I just remembered, we have two shulker shells, meaning if we take a chest and our little shulker shells, oh, this is a big moment, guys. Ba bam a shulker box, no more sacks. Before we head into the vault, I am interested in spending our skill point. There's a few things I've been thinking about. However, I think we're going to go Vein Miner, considering how useful Vein Miner is. And we're going to take Vein Miner Fortune, which adds a level of fortune while using it to mine blocks. So we only mine two blocks instead of the four that we normally would. However, we get an additional level of fortune. So that's pretty powerful. Aw, oh, yeah. We now have Fortune 4 while using this pickaxe, which is going to make Vault Ores much, much, much more common. In any case, I have a goal. I want to get to level 6. That's right. I want to get to level 6 so that we can get two skill points to unlock a level of haste. I think having a level of haste is going to be so important for continued Vault Runs. So... I have to say, without further ado, I don't have any blocks. Now, without further ado, yeah! Okay. One standard beginner's grace vault. I think once we hit level 5, we're going to start getting modifiers, random modifiers to our vault. Also, this is a fun theme. Wait, come on now. This is a fun theme. I like it. It's, it's piratey. It's cool. Let's see this new axe in action. Yeah! Oh, come on. Wah! Oh! 24! Whoa! This thing is powerful! Amazing! Ooh, hello, Thanos, I think. Oh, one second. Hold on, guys. I want to I wanna do the... Well, do I actually want to do a Thanos Altar? Thanos Altars require you to give up time. Three minutes of time. I don't know that that's necessarily worth it. But maybe just for the fun of it, right? Like, it's our first time seeing one. We sh Yeah, three minutes. Maybe we'll get something good. Silver scrap! Hey, you know what? That ended up being worth it. We need silver scrap. Hello, Benny-a-tite. That's a big one. Benny-a-tite. Ooh, and a pay -night. Wow. Those are the two big ones right now. Benny-a-tite, if you remember, helps us unlock mods. And pay -night, if you remember... Helps us craft more gear, like the Red Vault Essence. Oh boy, a challenge room. The wild, oh my gosh, and another elite zombie. Wow, that is pretty lucky, actually. Ooh, maybe I go crazy and try to melee this guy. I don't know, it's pretty dangerous. I do so much damage. 
Well, let's see. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, we got this. He's slow. Oh, yeah. Wah! And that's another 1,300 XP, if I remember correctly. How cool. Now, this room is a pretty scary challenge room. You can see it's full of gilded chests, but it's also full of unstable t TNT. If I'm not... Oh, boy. Oh, boy, oh, boy, oh, boy. Okay, things are getting crazy. That's an Omega. That's pretty huge. And if I'm not careful here, though, I could set off all of this TNT. Just touching it is enough to set off the TNT. It is unstable. I can't break it. I can't click it. I can't do nothing. So we're going to have to be pretty careful. I think if I hit it with an arrow, it's okay. Whoa. Oh, and these pressure plates, I should be more careful about, actually. They're very dangerous. They can be primed with TNT. Oh, boy. That's a few traps, not gonna lie. Wow! That was three vault diamonds in a mystery box. Oh, boy. This challenge room is so lucrative, but we gotta be super careful. Especially because we're in a theme that can spawn creepers. And I don't think I have to tell you why creepers in this vault would be scary. Also, stop banging on the door. It's so loud. I'm gonna have to remember to... Oh, silver scrap! Ah, that must come from the gilded chests. Interesting. Wow. Six silver scrap from just that one room. It's like the vault gods knew exactly what we wanted. Oh, and more gilded. Whoa, uh -oh. that's no good. Poison's pretty deadly. Oh, jeez. Boy, I sure am getting trapped hard in this one. Oh, that was slick. Ah, uh, that was cool. Ooh, mud box. I know these last few episodes have been pretty vault heavy, but man, I can just not get enough of these things. And besides, there's so many useful resources we can get by running them. There's no harm in it. Hmm. Wow. This is a cool room. That must have been where all the scary mobs came from. Neat! Oh, and a healing cloud! Thank you, game! Uh, all good things come to an end. Whoops, bumped my head. Probably should head back now. No reason to lose all this cool silver scrap. Yeah, I'm right behind the uh, vault room, too. Perfect. Well, it got a little dicey here and there, but honestly, I'd call that the calmest vault we've ever done. Nice and peaceful. And a great amount of loot. Sweet. Wow. Yep. Mobs unalived. I almost forgot the elite we did. Wow, wow, wow. Good stuff. Wonder how many coin piles we broke. Wow, five trapped. That, that's pretty significant, actually. But a lot of gilded. Look at that. More gilded than regular. Ooh. And even an omega. And let's see. Oh, yeah. 41 coin piles for 410. There's another level. Wow, five vault diamonds? Oh, I wonder if there's anything else in here. Yeah, look at all this. Sweet. Eight silver scrap, huh? Now we have some silver scrap. That could get us somewhere with our pickaxe. Hmm. But first, we have a few boxes to open. Mainly seven relic booster packs and four mystery boxes. That can be pretty huge. Aw. But mystery boxes? Yeah! Okay, a little bit of iron. Wah! A diamond. Very nice. Wah! Some emeralds. Come on. Give us something good here. More diamonds. Five of them. Not bad, honestly. Some basic resources, but I certainly can't complain. You know, now that we have silver scrap, let's see. What? We still can't do anything? Oh, not enough chromatic steel, eh? Well, that's easily fixable. You see, chromatic steel is pretty easily crafted. You just need this carbon stuff and this chromatic iron stuff. If I turn all of our carbon nuggets into full carbon, oh, in even 19, set them here, and then do this, 
we can make, yeah, wow, 16. I can make three more if I wanted to, but I might as well hold off for now. Get out of the way, dude. 16. Ooh, now we can increase our mining speed or reach or durability. I'm going to go with mining speed. You'll see it takes 16 plating and bronze. It takes six of the chromatic. Ooh, that's a lot. And when I click this, a few things happen. Wow, that was a that was a pretty good mid-roll, plus two mining speed. This little yellow bar went up, it took away our resources, and that 100% turned into a 95%. Once this yellow bar reaches this marker, our pickaxe gains a socket. This is the percent chance that the pickaxe survives the crafting. That's right. There is now a 5% chance that every time I upgrade this pickaxe right here, it will break. I'm feeling gambly. So I think I'm going to grab our vault plating. Oh, wait, we only have five. Oh, we're kind of out of vault plating. Hmm. Interesting. Looks like we'll have to do some more plating runs. But for now, I think this guy has just become better than our diamond pickaxe. So let's enchant him up and do a test. Okay, we've got all of the necessary enchantments on the vault pickaxe. Let's see how it stacks up. How about against four pieces of deep slate? All right, diamond pickaxe first. Okay, okay. Not too bad, not too bad. Vault pickaxe? Hmm. That actually felt pretty similar, I'm not gonna lie. Maybe we need to upgrade it a little more for it to be better. And I don't want to start chipping down the durability until it's nice and upgraded. So for now, I think we're still going to stick with the vault, the, the non-vault pickaxe, I should say. But I think it's definitely going to get there and going to get there soon. Before we get into our next vault, some of you have, may have noticed I picked up a loom in that last one. And that is actually for this recipe right here. A bounty table that's right we're bounty hunters now and just look at this thing how pretty when i open this you'll see a bunch of things active completed and available these are bounties quests that you can receive for the vaults so this is a kill entity let's see kill strays 28 strays and if we do that we'll get 1600 vault xp six skill essence and uh what is that 87 vault bronze Ooh. And a mystery box. Uh, mine four Laramar ore, and we get two pieces of vault. <gasps> wow, that's pretty good. And then also find seven silver scrap, and we get something called an ore, two orbs of regret, 11 Beniatite, and a chest plate? Hold on a minute. Beniatite, right? This guy is used in crafting these perfect beniatites, which are used in crafting extraordinary beniatites. So you need 16 to get one knowledge core, and knowledge cores make knowledge stars, which give you research points. Hmm. Only seven silver scrap, eh? We're kind of looking for that. Okay. Now, we can abandon this if we want to, but there's also no time limit on us completing it. And I'm pretty sure we don't even re-roll them when they're completed. I'm not sure. But we're now on a quest to find seven silver scrap. And we get all of this amazing loot. So uh, what are we waiting for? Slime. We're, uh, we're waiting for slime. We don't have any. But in the meantime, I can go boop, boop, boop. Easy peasy. But slime, hmm. Nothing a little swampy biome couldn't fix. Oh. 2,000. Jeez, that's pretty far. I suppose we could do nether travel. You know, I am many things in life, but admittedly, I'm not terribly patient. And I don't really want to actually have to, like, you know, walk through the nether the gross i would rather walk above the nether yes i have made the decision that we are going to the roof of the nether 
I just need a block at level Y127. So right on the right, targeted block. I need that to say 127. Hello. Also, this is a cool, probably quark feature, I would guess. Quark is kind of the one that adds all these cool things, but I love this. This is awesome. I think they should be in vanilla Minecraft. Oh, I can't, uh, I can't exactly get there. Hmm. Ooh, idea. Boy, I am too good. Ooh, excuse me, guest. And there's a few blocks up here, but this is the one I want. So, super important to note down, 172, 127, negative 18. Remember that for me. Put it in the comments. 172, 127, 118. If I mess this, or right, negative 18, not 118. Eh, eh, testing you. Okay. All right. If I forget this, it's not gonna be that big of a deal. I came prepared, but imagine that I'd be stuck forever. All we need to do is move forward, hold jump, throw the ender pearl, and it's as easy as that, ladies and gentlemen, as easy as that. And I believe if you guys are right in the chat, we're standing right on top of our block. So I'm just going to mark that there and get to building a fun little contraption that will uh, let us get back here whenever we want. Okay, this little contraption should be just about everything I need. All we have to do is flick this lever and spam right click onto this corner while we're flipped under the trap door. Except I actually have bound my use or place key to X because that'll actually spam it if you hold it down. So fun Minecraft fact, if you want to do something really quick, just, you know, watch this. Yeah, all I had to do was hold down X. And it spammed all that. So that's a pretty cool feature. And it should help us. Admit I'm a little nervous. But there's nothing else to do than just uh, get going with it. Uh, I hope that doesn't mess anything. Ah! That scared me. I don't think it worked though. No. Okay. Retry. Alrighty. Let's try it again. Hopefully this works this time. Ooh. That's a good sign. I think that means... Oh yeah. We just broke bedrock. We just broke bedrock. We just broke bedrock. What have I done? Okay. Let's see if I did my math right. Aha! Right over there. Awesome. Well, that took longer than I thought it would. But we are finally done. And I have a tiny bit of slime balls to spare. But a slime farm is definitely something we're going to have to work on. Ooh, good thing I grabbed those. Okay, this next one's pretty easy. I'm excited to jump right into this. And remember, seven silver scrap. That's what we're looking for. Ooh, just got to check I got all my goodies on me. Ah, blocks. Always blocks. I think I'm going to bring some deep slate. To be perfectly honest, it's not that bad to mine up and we have so much of it. Okay. First level 5 vault. I think things might be a little different because we're level 5. But don't quote me on that. Uh, I guess it kind of doesn't look like it. So, maybe I'm wrong. I just realized cobbled deep slate is the worst block to have brought into this theme. Wow, that's... Prove me wrong. Oh, what is that? Hold on, that looks interesting. Oh, it did just spawn something, it sounds like. Alright, something's definitely over here. Oh! Oh boy, this might... Yeah, this is a dungeon. This is an ornate dungeon! Ooh, redo of that coin pile dungeon we could never do. Awesome. This is gonna be so much loot. I wonder if we'll get any bulk here. Yep! Wow, right as I said it. Omega. Love to see it. Okay. Gilded chests. I believe they have the silver scrap in them. Yeah, and there's a little bit. Whoa! Wow, that jump scared me. Even spawn.
spawned these guys. Is, like a, is this a POI right here? Oh, yeah, it's an ore POI. It's just only got an iron ore in it. Oh, maybe it's got more in it. Let's see. No. Unlucky. It's all vanilla ores. Hmm. But I saw this altar, and I thought, why not, right? It's only hearts. Easy to do. And it led me to an awesome gilded altar. So perfect. Or gilded altar. Gilded POI. Ah, get away from me. Oh, and silver scraps. Didn't know those showed up on those. And the bounty's completed. Just like that, folks. Wow. I don't know. Maybe it's worth it to just leave the vault. I mean, we kind of got what we came here for. Well, nah, we have 13 minutes. There's no reason to waste a vault, right? Uh-oh. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. That's no good. What? That's more mobs than I feel like I can reasonably handle. Oh boy, that this might be it. This could be our first death. Okay, all right. No, oh, I don't have enough mana. Get me out of there. Oh, ooh, ooh, wow, that was, ooh, ah, it's okay. Calm and peaceful. We're not going back in there. Nothing, nothing's worth it. Nothing's that worth it. And we're just gonna block that all off. Ah, okay. Let's let's regen a little bit in this room. What's going on over here? Is this another dungeon? Oh, lordy lord, it is. Oh my gosh, it's an ore dungeon. Wow. That has got to be some of the best luck we've had so far in this vault you know we could have stayed in this vault for a little bit longer but there's just something about it that's making me nervous and i'd really like to just get back to my cozy fort and my awesome bounty table ah two and a half thousand xp not too bad not too bad at all in fact a little bit of burger and we'll reset Whew. Let's get this loop through away. You know, this vault alloy find is actually pretty cool, but we're going to be getting into vault alloy a little bit later. Not right this second. That was a bit of a stressful vault, but boy, do we have some cool rewards. Let's see. Relic booster? Yeah, nothing. Maybe something cool on the vault axe. Hey, it could be Omega. It's scrappy plus, right? The plus means it could be anything. It was scrappy. Huh? Uh, eh, that's okay. But don't worry, we can actually put this to good use with, I think it's called, like, the Recycler, is it? No, what is it called? Uh, yes, the Vault Recycler. This little guy, if we were to make it, we could turn our Vault Axe into some resources, but at the moment I don't think it's important. I'm gonna wait on the Mystery Boxes. Because I want to claim our reward. Boom. Oh, right! You get XP! So that leveled us up. And, for the first time properly, we get a crate. Now, we already know it's inside of that crate. It's everything that the reward table was going to give, or the bounty table was going to give to us. Boop. Cool. What do these do? Orb of Regret. Do they craft something? I don't actually know what those do. 11 Beniotype, 40 Bronze, and of course, a chest plate. Well, I'll put these with these guys for now, because I have actually no clue. And I think it's high time I craft some of my Bronze into Silvers to save space. Yeah, I gotta organize this chest a little better. Chest plate, though? Ah, our second piece of Vault gear. This could be huge. Ooh, Rusty Knight chest plate. Five armor. That's a little better than three armor. Oh, an empty, an empty suffix. Whoop. But I'm going to be honest, I don't like that mana roll, so I think I'm just going to wild focus it. Yeah, let's see. That's pretty good. Not going to lie. That's pretty good. Max roll on health and a mid roll on item quantity. 4% more items and more health. Don't mind if I do. Ooh, and my fist looks all cool now. What's our defense at now? 12. 
Ooh. We're getting close to a full armor bar, too. How cool. Now we get to open these mystery boxes. There's a one in, like, 2,000 chance we get some crazy rare stuff. Whoa! Okay, that's actually pretty big. This is an Upaline. That is a unique... That is a unique gem. All the unique gems, there's nine of them, are used to make a pog, right? This guy right here. Pogs are used in a ton of crazy powerful stuff. So it's a good thing that we just got this. Those are very rare ores. More painite. We already know why that's exciting. And a few more diamonds. Not a bad haul. I wonder if there's any more bounties we could take. Oh. We can still take these bounties. For Laramar? For all this? Don't mind if I do. And you know what? That last of all, I don't know. Not a whole lot felt like it happened. Maybe we run another one? Bop, 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 bop. Ta-da! Oh, and before we jump into the vault, I just looked. We have the skill point necessary to grab haste. Look at that upper right corner. Aw, oh, yeah. Permanent haste one. And... Reminds me, we can upgrade, I believe, our pickaxe. No? Oh, we don't have enough vault plating. No! Maybe I steal a little from here. Yeah, there's no harm in it. Make it faster! Ooh! Oh, yeah. Well, I suppose I should quit waffling about and go on a search for those four Laramar... And, uh, okay. Beginner's Grace, Chunky Mobs, and Trapped. We have modifiers. Chunky Mobs is 20% mob health, and Trapped is plus 110% trap chance? Uh, I hope that's a typo. That would suck. Also... Our first modifiers are both negative? That also kind of sucks. Aw. Well, at least it's a nice theme. Suppose we're looking for ores. I, I guess I should test if all of my chests are trapped. No, okay. It's a typo. That's, that's nice, at least. Oh, this is so much faster with haste in this pickaxe. Amazing. Whoa! A blank... Seal. Okay. That's pretty fun. Blank seals can be crafted into some really interesting things that change the vault in some fun ways. Whoa! Omega and another axe! Not too bad. Gosh, this crossbow is amazing. It's a literal lifesaver. I believe it has on multiple occasions saved my life, and that's a Laramar. Nice. Two Laramar! Okay, that's half of what we need already. A black opal, excuse me. We're so lucky right now. Ooh, I think that's wounded eye at the moment. Aqua affinity. Aw, oh, yeah. Sweet. Another Laramar. That's three out of four. Oh, another ore. Under two. Wow. Uh, I think the game wants us to have this. There's a Benny boy. But can we get the lighter blue stuff. Not quite here. To keep looking. Alright, how about on yonder? Oh, there it is! Wow! Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. I can't believe it. We just did two bounties in two vaults. Waha! We're bounty hunters now. We're amazing. Honestly, I'm just gonna get out of here. Nah, I'm not. I'm gonna go one more room and then I'm gonna get out of here. <laughs> I feel like, I don't know, I, I, have, I feel it on my bones. This one room greed is gonna really pay off. I don't know why. Ba ba ba, we're bounty hunters and we're so cool. Cause we hunt the bounties. Do, 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 do. Are we monolith lighters? That's the question. Oh my gosh, we are. One more monolith, huh? Uh oh. 
I don't like this situation. Oh dear. Getting a little sandwiched here. Not good. Get out, get out, get out. Oh, healing cloud, actually. Healing cloud. Ah, nice. Okay. Get out, get out, get out. That guy looked fast. Pretty sure he was. Okay. Where is I going here? Uh, west, I think? Oh, dear. Oh, I'm definitely lost. I would have mined this Laramar already. That's not good. That's no good at all. Hmm. Alright, we have two minutes to find our way. Oh, dear. I let the greed consume me. I lost my way. Just have to find those walls again. Oh, I found them. Okay. We're unlost. I'm pretty sure that would oh. put us at the back of the find the exit. I think I did. I think it's there. Hold on. No way. Uh, there's no way. No, I, I refuse to believe that I've managed to both complete a bounty and the objective in one single vault. Oh my gosh. I am so glad that I decided to run another vault and go over time. If I turn the corner here. Okay, that's fine. Oh boy, alright. It's getting tight. We're gonna have to really get moving, but I'm pretty sure the vault exit is right next to us right now. Oh man, we gotta move, we gotta move, we gotta move. This is gonna be so tight. I'm just gonna drop some blocks. So we don't have a full inventory. Okay. Oh, I'm... Wait, what? No, what? What is this? What is this? Oh, are we going to die to the timer? Oh, no. And there it is. Right at the end. I lost my way. Well, as you can see, we still have all of our gear on us. Oh. Our first death. Kind of, well, our second death. Oh. So crushing. Did we still complete the bounty, though? We do. Okay, that's, that's not so bad. Yay, we still get the bounty. Nice. All right. It's a little less sad, but ah, uh, it still hurts. It still hurts. But I have some cool leggings. Let's roll them. Ooh, look at them go. Wow, that passed Omega. That That's painful. Ha, <laughs> two rusty knights. That's funny. Uh, five armor, two health, and soul bound. Nice. Or six armor. <gasps> Item quantity and a suffix. Well, you know we have to. Uh, 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 we don't have any vault plating. Just two more. Maybe we'll get vault plating from this. Uh, can we craft vault plating? No. Oh. Well, yeah, that's appropriate. We can still use these leggings. I just wish we had some way to modify them. But, you know, I mean, that does bring our defense up to 17%. <sighs> What's worse is that's all the time I have for this video. In fact, I'm pretty sure we're over time. Oh dear, oh dear. Sucks to end on a sad note, but sometimes things just don't go your way. Well, next episode, we're going to be taking a break from the vaults. That's right, we're going to be doing some non-vault stuff. Prepping ourselves up for more crystal crafting in the future. And until then, I hope you enjoyed. Like, comment, subscribe, you know that stuff. Gotta do those call-outs. Ah. <sighs> Woe is me. Woe is me. Until the next video.
Bye, everyone.